Celsius. Let's meet up. Mm. So they meet up. Now we're moving. That was an actual oh. carjacking. up on the Albion drone facility where the micro drone is being developed. This had better be worth it. It will be. You're going to need to disable the security system protecting the R&D lab. Don't let the side down. Security's down in the R&D lab. The plans for the microdrone will be in there somewhere. You can leave whenever you like.
safe for now. Now that we have the schematics, we can make micro drones of our very own. Better move fast on that, Bags. We need to get into Tidus ASAP. Shut down Project Themis before Nigel decides to launch. And with what he was saying, we don't have much time. on your map. successfully trialed our first micro drone and it's officially as cute as the dickens i've decided to name it sebastian time to break into titus and take away nigel cass's newest toy project themis vaguely any idea where that name comes from greek mythology themis was the goddess of divine justice you know the one with the sword Ooh, that is so nigel fucking cuss See? School's useful for something besides social maladjustment. Find the schematics of the building and I'll work out the location of the Themis project. Down you go. Take a breath. Who's next? Save it for later. Step aside, peasant.
easy.
ground for anything named Themis. On it. <laughs> Well, if I was hiding a top-secret morally dubious drone project like Themis, I would put it in the secure vault on the lowest level. You will have to hack your way past some pretty serious security, however. The elevator that leads to the secure vault that houses Themis is locked down. You will have to access the bypass terminal to use it. You will require a spider bot. You'll be using Sebastian and the rest of the microdrones to bypass security. But first you'll have to get by that laser array. I suggest a spider bot and steady nerves. On it. Our job is not an easy one, but it is an important one. Right now, we devote countless hours to intelligence gathering, and still things slip through the cracks. We're doing our best, you tell me. We are, but our best isn't good enough. It doesn't sound... But even we 
I'm perfect yet. Yeah, no like that. That strikes a humble note. We make errors in judgment. That's human nature. But we cannot afford errors. We are the last resort to protect the people. Project Themis will dispense justice and protection. It will use data to predict the patterns of crime and abuse. It will let us transcend the faults in our own nature. Not bad. Yeah, they'll have questions, of course, which is fair. It's an extreme measure. And there is potential for abuse, but uh, this is what London needs. This is what you and your friends have been training for. Time to crash the security grid for Daddy. Now for the maiden voyage of our micro drones. That's the spirit. Should be pretty sick. Meet Sebastian, another of our countless microdrone allies. All named Sebastian, of course. You can't iterate on perfection.
destroy them, Sebastian, and for God's sake, be careful. Father very proud, Sebastian. Oh, right. You should be able to access the team's project room now. Let's ruin Nigel's fucking day. London. Once a beacon of civility, now a cesspool of lawlessness. It is clear that humanity can no longer police itself. Fortunately, we don't have to. Welcome to Project Themis. Albion has found a way to apply an existing system, LifeScore, a data aggregator with biometrics, personal information, to our new autonomous drones. These drones can identify, isolate, and terminate threats before they can do harm. They can go anywhere, see everything. They could kill a man alone in an alley or in a crowd of hundreds with perfect precision. Themis drones can do what humans have always struggled to. Act immediately and decisively. Score algorithm, my algorithm. I should have scrubbed it before I left. What do you mean, Hamish? You know how Themis works. No, fam. Well, yeah. This was years ago. We were developing a life score algorithm for what Cass called a peacekeeping system. It's supposed to identify vulnerable civilians, not target them. Bloody hell. So, in theory, Themis could be programmed to target anyone based on any number of parameters. Exactly. That's the way Cass thinks. Genius, but twisted. We have to stop this. And I know how. We delete the life score data, and Themis is done. My God. All right. Done. Yes, we'll have the award ceremony another time. Get out now. entertaining. I've intercepted an audio transmission from Nigel Cass. Yes, this is great. I cannot believe No, no more excuses. This is my city and I will not have dead sick ruin my plans for it. Themis was poised to change London, the world, and this group of... And Hamish fucking Balaji? I want them all. They made you all look like fools. They walked Calmly into the White Tower, and no one, not one of you, stopped them with all our vaunted security measures. So do any of you have anything to say? Nothing. Well, everyone, and I mean everyone in the organization, will be revetted immediately. Someone help them, that's certain, and we will root them out. This time, we will get them all. Well? 
that's about done it. Cass is going to steam about this for a while. No more life score, no more Themis. You did it. We couldn't have done it without your help, Hamish. Next time Nigel Cass starts causing trouble, we might just have to call on you again. Uh, not much of a joiner, fam. Considering how my days at Albion ended. But I'll be keeping watch on them and Cass. Maybe feed you lots of intel. And there's still the question of Zero Day. Remember them? Completely gutted DedSec 1.0. Cass had a hand in that purge, Bagley, and in the bombings, so we'll gladly accept any help you can give us, Hamish. Cheers. Not too bad for a first go, if I do say so myself. You wouldn't have been recruited if DedSec thought you'd be killed that easily. Um, was that a compliment? Bagley's got a special style. You'll grow to love it. Well done, by the way. In the last adventure of Detective Bagley and his occasionally helpful human sidekicks, we discovered that a billionaire tech mogul and a war profiteer both had secret plots to exploit human suffering and murder thousands. A shocking twist, I know. Speaking of the people we most suspect, Mary Kelly's slave trade is bound to be any day now, and we also just received a distress signal from a coffee shop of all places. Maybe the Wi-Fi's down or something. Is that relevant, Bagley? Yes, obviously there's more to it than that, but I knew I had to make a joke or you just tune it out. I've marked both leads on your optic. 